So the materials you will need are some silver clay, some tan clay, which is right there, and blue clay. You're going to need a needle tool, a ball tool, and a blade. So let's get started with this clay muffin tin. The first thing you want to do is take your silver clay and you're going to shape it into a rectangle. And you want to make sure that your rectangle can fit six of your ball tools in there. So just flatten it out and shape it. So then you're going to take your ball tool and you're going to poke six indents in there. Two, three, four, five, six. And adjust them if you need to by rolling around. And I'm using a large ball tool. This is what it looks like compared to my fingernail. Or my unpainted fingernails. So that's what that looks like. So this is where we're going to put our muffins. So you're going to take a little more of your gray clay and you're going to push it down and you're going to make a sheet not too thin or not too thick. And we don't want to use a roller or a pasta machine because it could make it too thin. So once you get the desired thickness about that much, you're going to take your blade and you're going to cut out two little handles. And they're not complicated at all. You just kind of make these little rectangles and attach them to the sides. So like that, but you might want to make them a little bigger. So attach it onto the muffin tin like that. And do that for the second one too. Once you apply the handles, it should look something like this. And now we're going to add the little muffins. And I'm going to add one little blueberry muffin. So how to do that, you just take a little ball of clay. A ball of tan clay. And make sure it's a good size to fit in one of the holes. So just push it in there. And make like a dome effect on top. And then you're going to take some blue clay, just a little tiny bit. And you're going to roll it into a snake. And you're going to chop off little blueberry chunks. And you're going to place them onto the little muffin with your needle tool. So you're going to place the blueberries onto the cupcake like this. And press it on there. Where's the other one? So put on all of your blueberries. I just lost it again. It's like sticking to me. It's really small. So put on all of your little blueberries. So next you're going to take your needle tool and you're going to texture the muffin and the blueberries. Like that. So just texture all around everything. You can make whatever flavored muffin you want. Like you could make chocolate chip, strawberry muffin, cinnamon muffin, or just, you can make a cupcake as well. But that's just how you make a polymer clay muffin tin with a muffin in it. 
So next you're just going to bake this and glaze. Um, that's optional. And you can add in an eye pin or a head pin if you want it to be a charm. But that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.